Hello, 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 and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy V. In the last episode, uh, we're grinding, and in this episode, we're grinding some more. Because, see, we're not even level 50 yet. Krill's only level 46. So, and we, everybody's getting close to mastering Mime Job class. That's nice. So, let's just get things started. Do, 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 do. Or to our favorite grinding spot. Maybe not the best grinding spot, but it's the one that we've got. How do these trees grow with stone underneath them? Trial level. How's everybody's life going? Mine's going pretty intense right now. It's not really true. I'm still doing the same old, same old, but, uh,. Don't know. I was looking for a woman, and uh, I don't know. Not sure this is the right time for a lady in my life. I'm not. Anyway, I've been watching the new Arrested Development. That's been excellent. Loving the fake block storyline and the old three million dollars. If you haven't seen it, I'll stop talking. Uh, not going near, thank you. Um, I've also been re-watching Supernatural. Yeah, from the very beginning. I've, uh, I've only actually seen the first maybe seven or eight seasons, I want to say. Maybe a handful of other episodes here or there. But uh, for the most part, whenever I've watched it, I've always stopped right, right when everything with the with like heaven and hell gets sorted out. I kind of lose interest when they try to go off in a new direction. I mean, that was the major overarching storyline for the first s five, six, seven seasons. I can't remember exactly, but once that was done, I kind of gave up on the show. But I don't know if I will this time. Hard to say. I'll only know if I even get that far. I don't even know if I'll get that far. It's just a rewatch, and I've been known to just abandon rewatches. But I like it a lot. Very slow up. Excellent. I'm getting very close to mastering mime. Gungnir? Fuck Gungnir. And of course he's gonna mimic that. Yeah. Got Okay, let's take a look at everybody's health. Let us continue.
getting lucky with all these Antetsukans, they could easily be fucking Gungnirs and not be all butthurt, I guess. I wonder what decides if it's going to be Zentetsuken or Gungnir. I mean, is it based on level or anything? Look at Ferris. She is going to master Mime in this battle. Maybe. Fuck Gungnir! Fuck Meteor! Didn't do jack shit! There we go, a little bit better. Of course, it's only hitting one enemy, and I wanted to take them all out in one swift stroke, but whatever. Let's steal from this guy, see what he's got. I stole Mithril Helm. Okay. There's Job Ability Mimic Acquired. Okay. Now, is it better to leave them as a mime or turn them into a freelancer? Vegester, are you watching? I don't know what's better, a freelancer class or mime class. Does it? Does the mime class get the same benefits as the freelancer class? What do you recommend? I think I'm just gonna leave them all as mimes because you get the three slots, and it seems like an obvious plus. But maybe there's something I'm not thinking about, I don't know. Take that, you son of a bitch. Cause me to bleed my own blood. Sprint see if I if mimes didn't do exactly what fire launchers do, just better, I wouldn't be able to So I'm thinking, if anything, just turn Barts and Kral back into freelancers, uh, since they could equip ribbons. Hey, Bart is about to mastermind. Shit. Good old Zeninagi. Yeah, little leveled up. Excellent. Okay, I need to go back and get MP. Because Ferris is out of MP, and Ferris is faster than Lena, so... I do not want to always have to just skip her turn. Just go back and get just use a cottage. It's not the end of the episode yet, don't worry. Don't worry, you pretty little head. Okay, let's go. Whoa, battle. Oh, I don't know if I've ever fought these guys. Is 
They bow down to Odin's blade just as well as anyone else, though, I suppose. Wow. 15 experience. What are they doing in this dungeon? Is this supposed to be the end dungeon? Okay, another new battle setup. Odin, please take care of this. If not, Zeninagi will do nothing because she's. Bart is dead. Great. Zed has come, please, thank God. Crow leveled up. Crow's job leveled up. Excellent. I should probably heal Bart, eh? Might be a good idea. I wonder if it mimics Gungnir or if it's got the same chance as using Zentetskin. Let's find out. Gungnir. Okay, he's miming it and it used Zentetskin. So, there we go. We should leave that one out. Well, good on us. Bart's leveled up. Okay, and Lena is eight away from mastering mimic mime. I mean, well, yeah, mastering mimic. And mastering mime. Come on, what is up with this? I don't really know, Gardner. I didn't even touch a girl. Thank you, game. Okay, one more battle ought to do it. <laughs> Lemon's job level. Okay, I'm gonna ask my phone right now. What's better? What's better, freelance or a mime class in Final Fantasy V? I, was, I thought I meant mine. Okay, not a flame topic, just discussion. Personally, prefer to have my attackers as freelancers. Okay, yeah, just as I suspected. Mages as mines. Well, this does prevent mages from equipping rods and staves. The fact that it allows them to have two magic commands and dual cast more than makes up for this, in my opinion. So, what do you guys think? Every time I use dual cast in my game with a freelancer, they had black and white magics. It would only give me a list of spells that a normal red mage would have. Of course, yeah, duh. 
you want to have the abilities equipped, so for example if you want to dual cast time with Freelancer you need to equip time and dual cast. Let's see... Magic Magic Dual Cast seems to be like the right setup. Okay, so let's get this setup going. Good job, Bart. Freelancer, yes. With. Um. Zeninage and HP plus 20%. Excalibur and Enhancer on him. Give him the Genji Helm. Um, Black Garb. And. Uh, Genji Gloves, I guess. Good job, Kryl. Freelancer, yes. And we'll put on her. Throw. HP plus 30. Put the Holy Lance and the Masamune. Crystal Armor. And Kaiser Knuckles, yes. Yes, 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 yes. And abilities, okay. Wait a minute. She never learned dual cast? Did friggin' Ferris? Yes. Okay, well then. Good job, Lena. Okay, she's not very smart. She's not very far from. No, 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 no. Okay, there we go. Now she'll learn dual casting, and looks like we've got more grinding to do anyway. We're pretty close to level 50, but this is going to be the end of the episode. Just going to get on back to the save point. Check out Bart's covering that shirt. Take it out, and I'm not talking about on a date. Feeling pretty good about this setup I've got going. Yep, I just looked it up online, and uh, now I'm really doing it. Fuck you, Gungnir. Why do you do this to me, game? Yeah, critical hit, bitch. What is this gonna do? I almost killed it. I'm amazed. I was expecting that to do puny damage. Another battle. The question is, the answer is no. We will use a cottage. This is a good grinding episode. Get a lot accomplished. 
feel pretty good about it. Well, let's save it one more time. Alright, that's going to be the end of this episode. In the next one, a little bit more grinding, and then we'll try the void again. I don't know how we're going to deal with those behemoths, or those king behemoths, or whatever the hell they are, with their damn meteor spell, but uh, we'll figure it out. We'll find a way. Anyway, thank you for watching, and peace out.